Hello, hello, hello. Happy Sunday. Again, Melanie. Yes, another Sunday. Come and quickly. Time is good. Come and go with me. The song says, Come and go with me. It's under the tree. Under the tree. Oh, Melanie has been there. Said that. No, that's the weekend. I said my week was good and the weekend was quiet. Yo, how good is your week? Very quiet, what slow. Is, what do you mean you're good your week? Explain that. Well, I've been doing personal interest things. Oh. Um, yeah. Well, I, Trying to get some stuff off the ground. Well, I was pretty good until I started to feel that funny today. I got some other issues going on with me. Yeah? Yeah, I overwake myself and I'm tired. And, and the, the sun is very hot. Yeah, and that's why I get my black color. You know, all that in the come to me. Oh, you know, I didn't notice your black color, you know. No? Mm -mm. You don't look at it? I didn't notice it. Why you don't look at me? I Tony Monroe is with us. Hey, I think I handsome. Hey, Tony. Hey, Sky. Hey, Antonis. What's going on? Papa, coming to see you all in a minute. You know, we can get, yeah, chicky with it. <laughs> yeah. So, what's up, man? Man, hey, Sky, you better answer me, boy, again. Anyway, like we say, we here, live and kicking. But I want to give you a, a, a week, a roundup of a week, what was going on. I'm still upset, Melanie. Yeah, why? Not with you, because I know you think I upset with you. I upset with you. I upset with these darn pigeons everywhere. These little, I call them pigeons now. Oh, I thought mm. you were actually talking about the bird because I'm like, I ain't talking but about they have a right I ain't talking about to be bird. here. I ain't talking about these little boys running around the street killing one another. I can't take this, you know. I I have a thing about, man, they have a thing about this. And I can't stand all these big coon men. Like, you when you're ready, they say, I listen to the Marvin Davis. He's talking about this, the mother and the parents. And then, listen. Well, you know, oh. people always blame the parents for the behavior of children. But I think that it's really unfair to some parents. While some parents do, mm -hmm. others uh, basically have done their best. If a child rebels, what can you do? So it's unfair to blame all parents. Yeah, because I think some of these friends battle hard to try to get kids in um, on the right way. Because mm -hmm. I know parents reach out to me trying to get me to talk to some of the kids and get me to talk to their son. And, and I know they reach out to the pastors. And, but I am just sick of the murders on the street. I am tired. I am tired. And I'm tired of the people blaming one another. You know, what I when I come to understand now mm -hmm. is that when I was growing up, mm -hmm. they had these camps. They had yeah. basketball camp, baseball mm -hmm. camp, soccer, all these camps. The church had the camps, uh, the, the programs. Everybody had the programs. Mm -hmm. Some of them still do it. But these parents can't find nobody to get these kids. Cause you mean by that? Because they have in the camps, but the camps now become, you have to pay for the camps. Okay. And the poor parent back in the day, you can't pay for no camp. And so back when I was growing up, camp used to be free, mm -hmm. where all they just bring a kid. Yeah, they get a meal, they get education, yep. and activities. And didn't matter if you had money or not. Now you look on the TV, camps $125, $350. Because like, it's look, all about the money. It's yeah. all about the money. And, and then you have to develop your kids. They can care less once you pay them money, the kids come. <laughs> and I'm a little frustrated because I can't take this. The Bahamian young men are killing themselves in the street. Even if they're Bahamian, the fact that they're men, they're killing themselves out and we need to find a solution. But when you, if we could just backtrack a bit, when mm -hmm. you look at the era, just look at the age range of these kids or these men that are... Uh, taking the lives of other people. Um, they grow up in the 
Hollywood gun, sex, and violence era. And we know for a long time parents were going out making the money. Their kids are home watching TV. TV is the babysitter. Then there are the other games, um, Nintendo and all those other games that basically program these young people. And then the negotiation skills, conflict resolution, all of these things. If you were to really look at it, um, those are things that the police themselves are trained in and maybe they need to become more involved in offering these sort of um, programs to young men because young men are the ones with the problem. They are the ones who are out there killing. When a female is killed, it's usually in the line of fire. Child is involved is in the line of fire, conflict between men. And so instead of blaming the parents, maybe the thing that the police could do is offer camps for young men targeting young men but the police offer to camps. address these. The police offer camps. But they offer the same camp that everybody else offers. Yeah. Everybody offer basketball. And, and same program. And you hit a button on the head. They need to offer these psychological camps, these camps that deals with behavior problem mm -hmm, issue mm -hmm. and control mm -hmm, issue mm -hmm. and, and, and deal with issues because there's so many... Listen, there's so many issues in the Bahamas, you wouldn't believe it that we deal with, and then you have the police force too, you don't want to spread them, but they deal with so much different issues. You see how much issues they deal with? Yeah, but then... <laughs> so some church organization, some civil organization... Partnerships, too. Yeah, partnerships. partnerships. Because, so, yes, the police is dealing, but like I say, they, along with the psychologists, right? Hmm. But they can help as well because oftentimes people, young men in particular, they see the police as their enemy. And so before they go and report an incident, report threats, they prefer to take arms up because they said it is no resolution. There's no recourse yeah. if you go to the police. So they take it into their own hands. What the, the, the country is going in a funny mood and only the black men are dying. Check it. Tell how many, how many, how many, how many white men do you know <laughs> that are in gangs in our country? Because really, the killing, when you look at it, is really gang violence that's going on. It's exactly. And you know, I'll be honest with you, I think the white man is the gang leader. Explain that. They explain the leader. Mm -hmm. Right. They can't come and they sell the guns to the black guys. They sell the guns to the leader and the gangs. That's how they do it. And that, right. and, and so they they, 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 they they miss a so and so with their store, but they're selling guns to the black man. Okay. And they both come in and they're selling guns. See, see, black men don't create crime themselves, you know. They can't create crime. Why did me and you killing one another? That's not creating crime. So what actually, who creates it? Um, the people with the money. And most times the people with the money is the ones that, who, who supply the stuff. Crimes develop, let me just tell you, most this gang crime is developing from this. We, me and you will think this, this gang crime well, is on the ground in the community on the ground. Okay. That's not it. Guns and drugs. The white man sell the drugs to the guy on the street. The guy on the street, because the drug has blood on his shoulder, the, dr the, dr the drugs is, have blood. Anytime drugs pass through a hand mm -hmm. or ship, somebody got to die. Now, why is that? Let me tell you why. Let me break that down for you. The reason is, Wherever you get this from, if I'm the white guy, mm -hmm. I gotta protect myself. I gotta make sure I get rid of him. So, no information pass over. So if, I give example, so if I bring a plane with drugs on it, 
Mm -hmm. I can make sure that I pilot in the plane or whatever can crash or something. Really? Yeah. So it's all to cover up? It's all, it's all, see, the drug trade is based on, you see, let me explain something. The drug trade, the gun and the drug trade is bigger than we think. I'm learning. Yeah. So if you have, see, ain't nothing that is good can end up, ain't nothing that's bad can end up good, you know. Okay. Because it has blood on it. Once it's blood on it, it, it's bound to, to, um, to, to end up detrimental to somebody. See, the white folks run the drugs and the guns through the black men, through the, through the black guys on the street. And they fighting for the guns and fighting for the bullet and fighting for drugs. See, because your word and my word, if I, if I sell you my drugs, go ahead. You can finish, go ahead. I, I am only smiling yeah. because it sounds like Hollywood. It sounds like something well, created in the, movie. in the movies. Yeah. It, it, and, and it doesn't sound real. It doesn't sound real to you, but let me tell you how it works. See, I, I did some study. See, mm -hmm. uh, that, that's how I can talk. Mm -hmm, from, mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I know you do your Oh, yeah. You know I can sit down and talk. To make sure you know investigation. Mm -hmm. What does happen? The white guy sends whatever, the guns and the drugs, to the Bahamas. Mm -hmm. It's been intercepted by somebody who, who pays and supposed to send the money back. Mm -hmm. But the money don't go back. So if the money don't go back... Then they don't get paid for their product. Right. The man, and so now somebody they have to, die. to go and claim. Because behemoth is a cricket. Somebody has to die. You see? Okay. So the man in well, he had a story. Somebody has to die. Can I ask? Go ahead, ask. Bahamians are cricket, you said. Oh, yeah. So on the scene outside of um, of the Bahamas, mm. wherever the drug is intended, it lands, is what you're saying. Mm -hmm. So the people, the middleman in other countries don't steal the stuff. They no, no. take it and send it where it's supposed to no, go. No, no. See, the, in other countries... Guys know they're going to die. Mm -hmm. And they can't play this game. Okay, so there's a fair element right. in there. So in the Bahamas, everybody thinks they can play this game and duck and dodge and hide. Okay. Because they live in the Bahamas. And they believe they can run this game. And this game doesn't work. And so what had happened, apparently, the guns are on now on the street. Because oh, okay. any Joe Blow... For a hundred dollars, for a thousand dollars, they get a gun, mm -hmm. and so the only thing is in power. It power the young man. This is power. See, gun makes you powerful. Mm. So, if you don't have a gun, he around him. But once he has a gun, he's powerful, and then he has to display that he is this person mm -hmm. who he ain't. Yeah, you're the boss. So you got to play. You got to play this role that you this mobile, big. So the minute something break down, mm -hmm. you then send out your word that this break down and I don't play. So the next time, next to next time, the guy do not play because he ain't gonna be around to play. Okay. So the message can send to everybody else. This Don't what play happened with to my you. stuff. Now, now after all this passed down and all this figure, now we're talking to the local street gang. Mm -hmm. The local street gang is trying to become the top street gang in the street. Mm. And so what had happened, the one who's the little boss, he was, we call pedal drugs mm -hmm. on the ground, mm -hmm. where you could buy the little $5, $10 to that. And once the little peddler, you have these little boys sit out and they pedal. So when he comes up short, he got these young boys who wants to mm -hmm. have stripes. Mm -hmm. So when he comes up short, he says, boy, I just do this and this and this and Deal with that. Then it happens that you kill my cousin. And my cousin is a part of me, but you kill my cousin in front of me. So you don't have no respect for me. Mm. So I now have to show you that you have respect for me. 
So this stupid thing of power, money and power, money and power, it's all about money and power. It ain't nothing but that. And the little girl, who little, with the sexy bungi, with the little shape, and the little, she get mixed up in the, your good child, get mixed up because the the girls in the Bahamas don't want a soft guy. They don't, a they guy like thugs. me, yeah, a guy like me too soft. I'm a gentleman. They don't mm. want that. They want a guy who, who got their quick back. Draw. Yeah, who got their back. Mm. Because I consider look like a punk to them. Mm. Because if they go out with me and the first time somebody say something to me, I say, let's go. They want a man who can say, oh boy, roll out. But then that's senseless, isn't it? It, it might be senseless so, so, to me and you. Because, again, mm -hmm. like I said, their role model is the TV. That's mm -hmm. how they do it in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. And so that's how you do it in real life. Mm -hmm. But we've been raised, the man who walks away lives to see, see another, another day. day. Right? But see, that's old school, but it works. Old school, but it works. Because most time. Okay, but I tell you, back in my day, how it worked. Mm -hmm. When I go in the basketball court and guys, we have a little push and shove and they take it a little further, I would walk away. Mm -hmm. But that's not end there. I deal with that later. Okay. The, the, the ones I move away to deal with that later. Mm -hmm. But when you deal with it later, it's a discussion, not a It might a be. Gun. It might be a fist fight. It might be a chopping across the head. Rock but and I, bottle. Yeah, I might deal with it later. And what what happens? Somebody in the excuse me in the community, who I respect, mm. will get involved and say, Boy. and 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 bring it under control. Yeah. But there's nobody in the middle of, in the street no more. Not when that. gun shots are being yeah, but, fired. But you cannot be scared of a gun when you call yourself the papa of the neighborhood. Well, look at it this way. If there is a heated thing going on, mm -hmm. it's not wise to get, even for the sake of peace, even though one thing I, I recognize is people are not fair for people are not ducking. What they're doing is pulling out their cameras and, mm -hmm. and taking pictures no, of it. The ones who pull the cameras is cowards. Don't mind that. They only, they, 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 they only want to make it popular on Facebook and say, oh, I dropped this. L let me tell you, when you become an activist around the world, mm -hmm. you don't be scared of nothing. nothing. But bohemian <laughs> activists, bohemian <laughs> activists only do it because they won't get involved in politics. They're looking for something. Yeah, okay. But when you talk about activists around the world, like me, or me, who, who quiet activists, and I believe in, I die for my cause. So if I get a bullet. I get about, see, you got to make up in your mind. Right, let's go back. You, Maybe a dead hero. Yeah. You see you see, you, you see, see what happened in Cuba this weekend mm -mm. with the uprise in Cuba. And, and CNN interviewed a guy. And you know what he said? He said, people are starving and hungry. And I'd rather die for the cause than sit back and do, do not, nothing. And let's go back to the Bible. The Bible say, if good man stand by and let evil prevail, in our country, people don't become activists because they want to elevate. They want to become in politics. They they opposed. don't want to they elevate. Want. They want to be elevated. Yeah, they want to be elevated. Mm. They're not willing to die for the cause. Mm -hmm. And we got so much fake. Like I, I just talk about Bahamian. I talk about Bahamian again. We can give it our topic right now. We're talking about Bohemian, right? Like I say, even with the drug trade, they, they, they play around. They think it's a game. Everything's a game to them. And so, an activist, they come in, it's like a game to them. Okay. So, when we, when we come back now to your point of yeah. blaming the parents mm -hmm. as we wrap this issue yeah. up, yeah. Um, it is complex and what you're saying is we need more people to be serious ah. about intervening, Correcting. quelling the problem, helping with our country right. to get these young men from start killing. 
I understand it might be hushing behemoth. That's what people think. Okay. okay. I feel like they're violent, this, that. And it's not all Haitian behemoths. No, it's not, but that's what they think. Majority are. I, 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 I understand that, right? But here's the problem. This, this little foolishness. Mm -hmm. It ain't foolish because people are losing their life. Gonna Territorial spin, war. Yeah, it's going to spill into another thing. And if all of us, every living thing and every living person in this country, don't get involved mm -hmm. and try to to um, um, help with this, mm -hmm. we're looking for a bad Bahamas for a future of our children. Mm -hmm. And we always stand by. It seems like our parents never stand by, you know. Our parents fight. Yeah. They, yeah. they fight. Our parents, let me tell you, then example, our parents would take the neighbor children to church. Yeah. But everybody to, have everybody have this hands off approach now. And it's really It don't work. Because it don't work of parent. Our affluence. Yeah. We have become too competitive rather than having a community um, money. mindset you want money yeah it's all about money. me and mine mm -hmm. and that we don't even help family no more much less neighbors so but if anybody out there serious about helping with these children helping these boys because we can try to save some of these boys we can try to save some they can hit me up and let's get a rolling let's get rolling i i, I willing to head it I, I am that's how frustrated it is. I willing to get in the street to head it. I willing to to put a program together. I willing to put my money in I I am you know I talk about this all the time. Time, I'm tired. money. Yeah. And so anybody out there, five five eight four nine eight two. Hit me up. I willing to put my life on it to help. What's our topic today again? So boy, I didn't. <laughs> Yeah. Trading upwards. What's the price for success? What's the price? You mean your woman likes success so much? You know your woman likes success. Now right? before you yeah, before I you know. jump on the women, <laughs> you said that there were two persons oh, who watched the show that oh, had Lord. questions. I, I know we are almost halfway into it, but mm. it is You want me to them uh, You want me to answer them two people? It's our policy. Well, it's well, our it's our agreement that and we tell our followers well, that the we guys, will answer their okay, questions. Let me answer the question. One of the guys want to know why women always think they're so special and um and why they believe that we should take care of them all the time. And what they offer. That's what one of the questions. That was a good question. You need to go back to some of our previous shows. Yeah. You, you, you discussed that. I discussed that. But let me let me just answer him mm -hmm. in short. Okay. So you get it. I even forget it. But anyhow. You forget your answer. Hold on, hold on. I can give my answer right now. Buddy, as long as you live on this earth, woman can... Woman like money. Yeah, 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 Is yeah. that the... <laughs> now, why don't you give him an old school answer? No, why don't you give him... You give the old school answer. Give him the old school no, you answer. Give answer. The man is the head. So if you, in a woman's life, that's your responsibility. That's only the Bible. Now, hold on. The Bible hold said up. woman hold, is a help hold, meet. Hold on. That's only the Bible. This is the Bible. Leave in the Bible. What do you mean only the Bible? Not the Bible. So what is the, what is the guide for living? That's foolishness. Hold on. Listen to what I say. The Bible tells you that man's supposed to take care of woman. That's what the Bible says. Okay. This guy might believe in the Bible. But you have to tell him that that's, so, the, that's the book so, of life. It might be the book of life. But he might believe in the Bible. So hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, hold on. so you think you're supposed to come in my life? Hold on, hold on, let me answer because You think you're supposed to come in my life, and you only supposed to bring front, and that, and I supposed to take care of you. Now you see. Yeah. Listen I to know. me now. Listen to me. Listen to me I'm carefully. Listening. You have to look at the nature of the relationship. If he is cohabitating with that woman, either as his wife, his girlfriend his baby mama, whatever, but as long as he is staking claim on that woman, he has a responsibility. But then, aren't she staking claim on him? 
Yeah, but then, then no, but what is society's we ain't role? That's society. We're not talking about society. So, so what, what are we using? We're we using the Bible. We're using society. We're talking about Jim. Why what that he are he write? We using why using as a standard? Why would what you is only the come guide? Up? Yeah, but why would you only come up in this relationship? The only thing you bring in front. And I got that's our culture too. Hold See, on. that's number three. Hold on. So don't I bring got, the culture. Don't bring on. the Bible. Yeah, don't bring. I got to work hard. Hold on now. Common sense. We bring in. I have to work hard. Take care of you. And the only thing you bring into the table is front. That I can find every day, 24-7. I can bring a girl in, get but one. that's not no, the no, case, though. No, no. Did he tell you that that's all that's she was doing? That's what he was, I guess that's what he was trying to get. Yeah, but then that's all he required, I guess. No, because, because he could cook for himself. He could clean for himself. And he cooked for her to so, clean yeah, for her. Yeah, exactly. So maybe... So, so see, why it can't no, be shared? See? So why it can't be shared? Because... What the standard was set at the beginning of the relationship. But y'all bring every standard. No, y'all, y'all, no, y'all. No. Only one thing y'all ever act like y'all want is, is sex. No, no, no. And then y'all don't give it to us. Then what? We got But that's not the case in, no, no, in, no. in the beginning of the relationship. Beginning the order to the end. We go from. You from don't the beginning, all y'all yeah. want is sex. When y'all so, had y'all fill of sex, then y'all look around for other things that a woman do and do not. And that is why y'all need to stop jumping in bed with women before y'all know what she bring the, to the table. But but the question is, and he the question, why is it you think that only one thing you bring to uh, because That's you not a woman think because that's you, what men Because you cook for me, you clean for me. It is you do okay, all this me. So she cooking, she cleaning. And she ironing, she go into the grocery store, she raising your children, but and she giving you sex, but and he, all you bringing home is the money. You but he stop to look at but he, like that. He, he didn't. All answer. he giving is the money. No, but he asked you for no children, cooking, cleaning. He asked you for none of that. What he asks and what else is he, he wanted a relationship to have some. That's what I think he said. So why he no, got? No, that's mixed up. So why he got up? He okay. For you to give him some, he got to spend his money. And if he don't spend his money, he get none. Okay. Okay. So what? So why? So what does he bring so to why, the table? Why other you can't than pay me the money? The question is, why you can't pay me for the sex then? Because you don't do all the other things. I, I actually do nothing. If hold on, if, hold on, hold on. Let's go back to the question. I want you to do nothing. All I want you to do. Is have sex with me. So therefore, you don't have to give me no money. Why? Okay, oh, okay, 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 okay. You okay. selling it? It is. <laughs> no, 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 no. But That's guess what? what? That's no, what you're doing. No, but guess what? Think about it. I think about it. When that woman, when you go to that woman, I, I'm only quoting now go what ahead. I've heard in go conversations, ahead. Go ahead. right? Uh -huh. This woman needs soap. She need sanitary um, materials. Mm -hmm. She need food to eat to get energy because mm -hmm. when you all men having sex and it good, mm -hmm. y'all just wear and tear the woman body. So why she shouldn't be getting some money from you? But let me give you an answer to that. I could walk around the corner, pay somebody $50. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So wherever get, you go, you can still be paid. Hold up, hold up, pay so why not pay the person who you say I, you love? But I ain't telling you nothing but no soap. So you're not going to do nothing. See, I actually, you have to take it yourself, right? So therefore... No, 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 no. no. So do therefore... You have, answer my if question. If I'm taking care of myself... Okay, so you should be I able don't to get yourself But if free. you're using my body, then yes. Well, no now. Indirectly, this is point This is point you can do. You mm -hmm. didn't button it. Indirectly, you sell it to him. So fair exchange because guess what? But, but men don't listen. When women want conversation and attention, they have to go look for their friends because y'all only want the sex anyhow. The point remains is this. Everything you will blame the man. He's he don't do this, he don't do that, he didn't do that. But that's but what men are doing. Hold on. But you never see if me and you married tomorrow, I tell you cook for me because I cook for both of us. Me, I cook for both of us, right? 
But hold Tony, on. you ain't see what hold the problem. I can clean. You see what the problem is in yeah, this I, I situation. See, but I can clean for you too. Mm -hmm. And wash all your clothes. Exactly. So the only so thing you offer me. So why is there the complaint? The bottom line is the two people that are in a relationship. The complaint is every need to woman work today. Together. Right. But the most every girl today want to believe that she's the prize. Yeah, and, and, and get the money. Why you can't clean and I clean? Why you can't cook and I cook? Why I, you can't I share don't know half why. your money? But society has come with this thing where if Charlie ain't got a man and he ain't taking care of bed and he ain't doing where, where, where we get this from? We have been conditioned like that. That's we, our culture. No, time to condition out. Because the young people ain't doing that. The young no, because you know what the young people are doing? Mm -hmm. They staying in their parents' house, they coming together, they having their sex, and they all going back home to their parents' well, house. Well, that's a smart thing, because you know why? They're independent. No, they're depending on their parents. But that's their parents. But they ain't letting you outsmart them. And I don't blame them. And let me tell you something. That's why he probably asked this question. Because society is bringing this on. That's not where it should be. Two individuals should have their own route. If they want to share, they want to... Shouldn't be... I should be bringing home the money and I should... If, what, what is if this? there is a marriage, if there is a marriage, there is the building of a future... The laying down of foundation for your children. So in such an arrangement, somebody should be doing it. And if both parties are working, then it should be 50-50. Majority of women today makes more than a man. So? Okay. So why than a man? Because he has less. But you know, more. you know, you want me to tell you what? Yeah. You want me to tell you the tell mindset me. of women? Talking nonsense. I'm going to tell you tell as far mindset. as I know it. The mindset of women is this. If they don't milk you all, then you all go out there and spend the money on another woman. Yeah. So that's going to be right. But it ain't right for you to be I, living here and not carrying your weight because when women get money from men it's never about the sex it's always about the home that is being established what world you live in every time <laughs> women get money from a man is about the sex no they use their sex for the money they tell you straight away oh child you can get none of this and you can get you don't pay the... so what do you all use sorry what do men use we have nothing to use all we could do is work why do you think all is dying? No, what y'all do is y'all take the money and your doggy and go around the corner and pay for the sex y'all don't want to pay but, for at all. But home. that's why we do it. Because the woman at home always try to put this muzzle on her neck. And so we have to On find, your neck? You should have yeah, just put the muzzle on your neck? On her neck. So we now find a way out to enjoy ourselves. To say, boy, let me, let me give you a story. I hate to even talk about this because we ain't going to talk about it. Check this out. This well, thanks to your Vinda. viewer. Vinda, watch this now. They, 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 they fix this. Do this. Da, da, do everything, right? But, but hold on. What? But hold on. You know. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're the father of two boys. Yes. Let me ask you the question. Ask me all your the sons get married. What is your expectation of your sons in their marriage? Answer well, that for me. My, in, 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 the, in my son's marriage? Yes. What is your well, expectation? My expect what role do you expect them to fulfill? I expect that they find a wife mm -hmm. who will share with them. Share her body. Share her money. Share her time. Share but everything. You, you mentioned something about window and door. and No, 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 no. But see, the problem is this. Bahamian woman has to slow down a little bit. They, they, see, they, hide they have what? They have to slow down. See, Bahamian woman hide in their basket, hide and they can reach it. So they make these men stress their whole life out trying to meet this. <laughs> so they need to spend more time in the bedroom, less time in the kitchen, less time in the living room, and less time in the front of the television. No, they need to spend more time in the bedroom because they got made. They make the man pay for the man do. But that's what I'm saying. Well, hold on. But then they don't want to stay in the bedroom. That's why the fella go out there. So, but I ain't even doing that. I got this. This society of, boy, I get ready to this. 
the society mm -hmm. of buying these big houses I know we, sh we only could afford this sending your child to this school but, you, but for, even, but, even but, but it, you make the man so stressed out because you make him want to want to pay for this hi Beryl hey Beryl and so the whole family stress out so the only thing you could come up with you better pay them these bills and do it but so it, but, it's, it's but, become but, but, so but, bad but but you notice as i have noticed Help me that better. the big homes are empty yeah the big homes are empty as soon as a couple establish themselves with a big house what happens? And you know why? It's because people do not spend time with each other. But they're busy spending their time making money, buying house, fancying up the house, paying for children to go to school. They never, ever spend time with each other. That's Marcy Swift. Oh, Marcy Swift. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hi, Marcy. Hi, Marcy. But, but listen, listen, listen. The, 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 the basket is so high. Who sets the basket hold on, hold on. so high? Him and woman. Because they, 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 they too much. Too, listen, they make the men work his backside off. But you all allow it. But you me You all allow it. You all go after those type of women. Because they're sexy. Okay. Because you want something sexy. In the okay. Right. But, but that doesn't mean. But then you go after the You have to be sexy. You go after the sexy woman mm -hmm. and you are misled. It's like the blinkers on your eye. You why don't you go after the not so sexy no, no, woman no, no. who is hard working, who is considerate, who communicates, who will do all the things and never ask you for Benny. Y'all go after these high maintenance. But women. hold on. You want to have something on your shoulder. Okay, so pay the on. price. No, 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 no. Don't have to be a price. There you could have will a decent, be a price. But, might be, but you could be a decent woman that's very attractive. Yeah, but then... And you don't have to stress but, me out. But has, has, has experience shown you different? Experience might have shown me different, but there got to be a, a diamond in the rock somewhere. Right? Got to be. Because... Sexy and pay the price barrels, eh? Ah, uh, listen. Got to be somebody who's sexy... Who just looking for a good husband and the look of a good man to go along and be with them you you can't tell me all in laws well you see now let's let's look at it this way it depends on your definition of sexy my definition of sexy because if you looking at the exterior and then these same sexy who can't and he ain't and who running you out the bedroom until you bring the money in? I looking for sexy when I put my eyes on her and she give me that wink. That's all it, it is. Yeah, so, so, but, but the if communication she don't sexy have, communication if, sexy in communication. But if she don't have the exterior qualities that most Bahamian men looking for, mango skin. Long hair. That's old school. Coke That's old school. Shape. That's old school. It's old, it's old school. Old school. What? Fool men look for them kind of things now. Let me tell you what, what man looking for. Mm. That's old school. Men looking, when they put an eye on a woman, you could see the way her bunks. The way she bunks, you know that's a sexy woman. Not only that, she but could wear peasy eh? and get cool up. But that's after y'all and get bike and sting and all that other things. She's very attractive things. inside. You know, you could see that. It's bubbling. But that's mm -hmm. after y'all and get bite. Then y'all begin to look at the bunks and all that. But before me, that, y'all be looking at this. Let me tell you. And I can talk that? with me. I talk with me. I was married. I was married. I thought my wife was sexy. Okay. Right? For 11 years, she was sexy to me. Now I know what happened on the 12th year. But I only tell you, 11 years. Now it might have been something I do. I know that, but it might have been something in the inside that I don't know I was doing. Something might have went wrong, right? So what I'm not blaming her, I'm just saying generally, something went wrong mm -hmm. that I wasn't sexy to her no more. And usually it ain't, see, let me tell you something, sexy and all of that is only going to last for so long. 
two. Could not cook, cook and clean better. The, 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 the question that even the Bible asks is, can two walk together unless they agree? So even the most sexiest woman will get on the man nerve if she is not doing what his expectations but, are. And the only way she's going to know his expectations is through communication. Listen, listen to me. And I talk, we talk early, but, 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 but why that I have to bring money, 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 money? Yeah, that's because, what the question yeah. is. And that's what I was off topic now yeah. because it's that's almost. Fine. That's fine. The okay. hour. I didn't get, I didn't get off topic. Let's talk about it. You have another question from another. Yeah, yeah, from family. a woman. Yeah, I, I, I get to that. But listen to this. There is too much foolishness. Why are you look at me like that? Foolishness. I'm listening. Are you sure? Hey, you. This woman around here believe that, that that all they're looking for is money, money. Why do you can't look for a decent man who got who can bring something to the table? Let me tell you something. something fully, Let me tell you mostly something. Mostly fans with money and who bring in the money. Just, they can't even afford you. You know what just went across my mind? Ask any person, any woman, ask even your sisters what it is that they were told as young people. You know they say love can't feed you, love can't put roof over your head, love can't love can't do nothing else because love is what love does. But, but and love ain't sex, by the way. But what about respect? respect Why is can't important. I bring respect to the table? Important. Why all these good things I could bring to the table? I don't. Why you just look at my finances? All those you know those things I bring to the table. But the thing about it is, Tony, it is not all women that go after a majority man's of women. wallet. Majority of women. They want, if you ain't bringing the money, especially these young girls today, we ain't talking about barrel them, barrel them, or they ain't sat in the way. But I'm talking about young girls. These young girls today, if you ain't bringing the money, you enjoy it. So the, his question was for me to just have a discussion, he wouldn't know why is this got to be money? Why this can't? Why this money, money, money? But okay, okay. But guess what? Again, it comes down to what you all project. If you you missing if the point. you no 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 I'm not missing the point. The the thing is if you as a man hold your money mm -hmm. and not dangle it in the front of a woman, she will walk away from you if she is a money seeker. If she's a no, gold no, 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 digger, no. That's she not your come. will walk away from you. Y'all don't come no, like that. y'all don't come like that. Y'all come dangling the money. So if you dangle a, 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 a candy in the front of a baby, what is that baby going to do? It's going to go after the candy. Yeah, no man. matter how ugly a face you make up at that child. That like, yeah, child no candy. So it's going after the candy. But but man, you know what I find out? Huh? Go ahead. Mostly, boy, I can say something like a shop this thing. Go ahead. It. You know, most of them people come and they're looking for money. They stuff even ain't good anyhow. So, I, I, one shake, rattle, and roll in your audio. Because, but, 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 see, that's but dudes ain't that smart. Are, that's how you are. Like, go ahead. You were about to say Yeah, go because ahead. dudes ain't smart yet. Ah. To figure these dumb women, i sorry, I got to call them like, these dumb women who believe they get one shake. Or they can put on sexy clothes. Because, because that's what, what you're looking for. No, 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 no. You're looking for sexy, so they give you all what you're looking for. That's now, what, when, when the proof drink, is in the pudding, the proof is in the pudding, and that is why, you know, today, parents who are trying to raise their children correctly are having a hard time because it's so many loose cannons Less hey, Baron, or no standards, <laughs> yeah. and and we who are trying have to our children have to pick from among. It's like like I know people say trying to pick peas or the shit. Yeah, because but, ain't nothing out there for them to pick from because but, the parents have stopped raising their children to have standards. Wait. No, the point I think this guy is making, right? I don't call it anybody, but no, the, no. the point I'm, the point I think he's making mm -hmm. is that the young woman today believe that all they gotta do is put some clothes on, and that's true. And they need to work no more. But that's true. And they true. need to bring them to the table. But, but that's I, true. But hold on, but hold on, men are becoming self-sufficient. Where 
men cooking, cleaning more than women now. And so what will happen to them? If men would do what they're supposed to do, those little things that think that they only need to put on the makeup and the clothes will cease to exist. No, but see, but there is never a market without buyers. But men now getting smart because they can say, well, how much it is? And you must just pay for it and get it over it. Okay. Because, because less fair exchange and then they'll have nothing to complain yeah, about. And then I, yeah, and then you, it less stress, less headache, less you ain't calling me, you ain't stress me, exactly. you ain't making me for nothing. Exactly. Why is it when you, the minute you meet a woman today, they telling you about these bills they got. I ain't you, I ain't you, Mike. <laughs> I only want to make love to you, or I only want to have fun with you, or I only want to marry you to be my wife. I don't want to. Well, guess what? Hold on. But, but, guess but, you, what? but I just reach. But guess what? What, what you showing me? And so if I come to you. So I'm cracking again. You showing if me. If I come to you and I share my burdens with you. All you have to do is have compassion and say, oh, I'm so sorry, but I hope you find a job soon. Ain't nobody tell you, have to, she ain't coming with a gun and saying, if you don't give me yeah, your money. But, but you don't know this until you done fall in love. See, this, this is a hidden... Well, then fall out, because guess what? You're not supposed easy to, to fall, fall in love. You're it, supposed to grow. And if you fall, that you means you're in love. a bad state. Listen to no, me. No, no. You're, you're supposed done to grow fall. in love. You're always falling in lust. Time. Most like you know when we come up. Fall I fall in lust. Every time he uses word break off when I tell those break, break off. Yeah, when and a woman say need to break independent. Off any way that a woman say independent, mm -hmm. man run, hall why? take. Why? What? Why? What you mean? Why run from an independent woman? Because if you independent, why you gotta tell me you independent? Well, <laughs> I can tell you why. I tell me why. Because because you lie. No, no. She is letting you know right up front that she is not dependent on you. And usually they're the women who basically pay their own way. A woman who says she's independent is a woman who pays her own way. But you don't have way. to tell me you're independent. You just, just show, show me. you, right? Why are you telling me this? You are like, most of them say independent, they're independent. Let me okay. tell you what they do. But that's, that's hidden, true because you don't have to right. say. You that's live the hidden agenda. what it is that you are. The hidden agenda so they can bake you and, and let me tell you they will bake you and tell you Ben they break, they break you so bad you may, listen they come and so good I, 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 one time you know I had one I I, I share my experience I scared them one time I had one come and <laughs> so say you are scared in that no thing. say so what you what you what you want you see how how, how I gotta get this here fixed you think this cheap eh? for me to be here and, and, and keep you, my hair looking good. I had to pay six dollars for this, you know. And I say, well, honey, you know what? So you want me to pay you sixty dollars for your hair to look good to me, so I can look at your hair. So I say, guess what? I like natural hair. I mean, <laughs> I just got. I say I like natural hair. So she said, what that means? I said, she said, but you can pay for natural hair too. I say, no, I like it when it just wash and wear. <laughs> so she say, boy, give me the $60, right? So I say, okay, I give her the $60. A week later, who do you think she got? She telling me about her son supposed to pay for this and this school, this and that. And, and then I realize... You're a financier. Yeah, I, I, I got to pay for this bread. This piece of thing, I got to pay for this. So I say to myself, Tony, look up in the sky. The sky clean and clear. You better get the hell out of here. <laughs> Farrah says she's an independent woman. Well, you might be independent. I mean, we talk about it, but if that dude don't take care of them bills in the house, you know how you're independent. He'd be out. <laughs> He'd be Anyhow, on the street. I think we have answered <sighs> that question quite nicely and... Let's see if we can get in the second question that you have, oh. and I think we're going to have to take on our topic of upward um, upgrading and up-leveling and the cost she asked or the price of success. How, how, was it, what's the question? How, why women so bad? What is, why women? Why, was it women or men? Why would a woman ask why women so bad? <laughs> 
<laughs> you slick boy. <laughs> Barrel. <laughs> Marcia, you see this? I mean, Tony is here trying to. Uh, why would a woman ask why women are bad? Yeah. Well, why she you ask why a man bad? Because. Women usually only observe what men do. Man ain't bad. Man. The song say man bad, woman bad. Six does the same Six thing. Six and a half. Man ain't bad. Same thing. Woman more bad than man. Because woman. I, I, I know one thing. What? The other song artists or writers said mm -hmm. the woman of the day is smarter. And say badder. Smarter but than the that's man. That's the same thing. Let me tell you how smart y'all is. Y'all will have me mm -hmm. in the church, praising God. Mm -hmm. And y'all say y'all gotta go back home to finish the pot. <laughs> and y'all go back again a little bit. That's as slick y'all is, y'all. Say what? <laughs> <laughs> say what? You know what I say. Y'all mm -mm. take me to church. We go to church on Sunday. No, I go to church. And they tell me, tell me if you get leave the pot home. Oh, if you get I leave the pot on the stove. And you go home. Why is I praising? You leave me praising God and you go on home. Get another praise. That sounds a little sinister. That, 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 that's real. Right, Barra? That real. Barra say, I hear him. <laughs> uh, listen to this stuff. What the question is? Why men so bad? But man ain't bad. You's a man, right? And you're in a bad man, so you need to talk from your own no, experience. But man ain't bad. I used to be bad. Man ain't bad. Who bad then? Man only do what woman let them do. Man ain't bad. Versa. Yeah, man ain't bad. And woman he, let, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me tell you why mm. man ain't bad. Woman, no. Okay, just as you marry, okay, you date a guy. You, you, the first time you meet this guy. <laughs> I, 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 I'm gonna break it down. I'm listening. Okay, you meet this guy. About six, so three, three to six weeks mm -hmm. or six months, mm -hmm. you you don't know this guy, right? You think you know him a little bit? That ain't enough time to know Okay, him, let's say six months a year. Yeah. Maybe, maybe. Okay, whatever. Because you're old school. Anyway, you whatever. No, no, no. Martin, listen, listen, six months is a period of familiarity. All right. So you're familiar with them. And in all honesty, you never know an individual. Okay, there you go, there you go. That's what it's coming to. So, you think you know him. But most men <laughs> like sex. We know what you show. Yeah. <laughs> we know what you but show. most men need sex. All men need sex. Right. So, if you're going to take a guy who likes sex and try to make him a gentleman at home, and a gentleman, woman try that, you know, woman is doing that. Woman is cause, woman is take man in and fix him up and hoping that he change. Woman is do this. Man, leopard don't change their skin. Only God get leopard. Only God is. Okay. So now you take this man. All man like sex. Okay. So if you only give him sex once a week, but he used to having sex every day, mm -hmm. you're only eventually. Down the road, he can go back to the old set. Okay, so that's one. That's one case. So he ain't yes. bad. So that's me, one. That's he, one. Him. That's one group of men. Yeah. What about the man? And you may think that women, there are no women out there who give their men sex. I was gonna say on demand, right? Or upon request. Tell me one. Tell me one. I waiting. <laughs> dun, 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 I can only speak dun, dun, from my dun, dun, own dun, dun, experience, right? Dun, because dun, 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 dun. I I can only speak from my own when experience. Married. When you was married, my husband could tell you he never had a problem with getting school. sex. Pardon? You old school. Most but, all, but, most most all the women today who married, they'll tell you, child, he you know. Good. It ain't I, nothing I about to, the school, I, you know. On, I used to give him this every day. They lie. It ain't nothing about the school. It's about the level of satisfaction that you have in your relationship or the level of commitment. Because women, there are women out there who say, 
even if they don't love their husband no more, they have a marital obligation and they fulfill that. But if, see, 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 see let me tell you one of the problems, man. See, if the sex is good, right, man will want it all the time if it's good. And the women problem. will want it all the time. Too. No, 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 no. Woman, if the relationship is good and still alive no, and well, no, woman is not gonna do that because yes, woman, women do. No, woman gonna yes, say yes, women do. Woman gonna say I can hold this because I want him get useless. Woman, no, no, women yeah, don't think like that. answer me, man. Somebody over there. Listen to me. Listen, listen to me. Yeah. Women, there are some women, and they are what you call stupid thinking women. Because there are some out there who say, oh, I'm going to give it to him. Just like you say, every day because. But then there are others who will say, oh, I'm Majority give people don't no, want to no, make no, you no, happy. No, 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 no. Majority no. people don't want to make you happy. And so that's why you don't need to be with somebody who don't want to make you happy. No, they, but they saying they doing good. So three times a week is good. But I'm going to let I'm you break down my body. You, no, I'm, I'm trying, trying to tell you that some woman, women... Some women have the mentality based on other people's experience exactly that oh why give it to him and he can still go there and oh, and and, and, and give it to somebody else bear, anyhow. Bear and say, bear and say so. Yeah, so Tony Audrey is right. Audrey is right. Boy Barry, let me tell you something. I had a lot of guys tell me I Went to a whole program, guys are asking Those guys. Those guys are with the wrong person. They might be the wrong person. Let me tell you what I believe. This is only me humble. Mm -hmm. Me being humble, mm -hmm. I believe. Mm -hmm. I believe the woman mightn't do it because a right or they ain't good or I don't know, but I believe that's the only reason why. But let me tell you something. But I believe if it's good, they should give it. No, but let me tell you something. You see, when you talk about good, there is good sex, and there is good sex, and there is very good sex, and there is excellent sex. The thing is this. Mm. I'm, I am inclined to agree that as Christians, mm. we limit our sexuality. Because sex in our minds is not something that is to be embraced and cherished, right? Mm -hmm. In our culture, sex is seen as something dirty. Yes, from the church perspective, yeah. 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 And not only that, people believe sex is only vagina, penis, penetration. Yeah. There is so many ways to enjoy your partner other than through. Yeah. When I said sex earlier, I meant the whole package. I didn't meant the... the Quite as right. just, just I mean, I mean the whole touching, feeling, hugging. Exactly. Yeah. So, so, so go, go, go on. Mm -hmm. So, the thing about it was men don't realize is... Happy mind, happy dick. If a woman mind is happy, your penis can be happy. I don't believe in that, you know. I, use, I hold believe on. it. Hold on, hold on. I don't believe you, it. You, but, if, and see, let me tell you something. Mm. If you're not the source of happiness, then that's the case. Yeah. But if you are her source of happiness, the only time a woman will deny you is if she's having a period. A woman will say to you, this, this is a true saying. A lot of women do this to you, say this to you. Just the words. Well, if sex to make you happy, something wrong with you. That's what they tell you. No, something is wrong with the woman who thinks that way. But that's and how you most. Know why? That's and how you most know women. What it is? That's how most women thinks. That's how mo most women thinks. They think that if sex gonna make you happy, then something is wrong. Beryl say to her, "What you put in it is what you get out of it." Twice a day for her. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Baron. I'm with you, Baron. <laughs> hey, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> now, that's what I'm talking about. Kudos to you. But, I salute you. But, Baron, can he get it twice a day if he doesn't have your head in the right place? Baron, it has nothing to do with head. Yes, it, it has, has to everything do. to do with the level of satisfaction Listen, if you that love she me. has 
with you. Yeah. See, in a minute, something. Love is a two-way street. Always remember that. It's give and take. She sex, said it right there. Yeah, but sex don't be a two-way street. It's what you sometime. give. Don't make it. Sex only be sometimes one-way street. But that's because somebody is out to lunch. Look, a woman is saying, I doing this because I will make you happy. That's what I told you earlier. That's what they do. They say, I, I need this because I In a committed relationship, the woman, woman will always want to make you happy. And what's wrong with her giving nah, it to you? She nah, want to nah. make you happy. In a good, in a relationship today, if you don't put that money on the table, that's the only thing you make a woman. That's the only somebody's woman. You don't go pay the bill. You don't pay. Yeah. You don't pay. But that guess bill. what? You don't get that money on the table. You, but guess what? You know what for it? Hold on. Put though. it on the dresser. Hold, Hold on, on the table. Though. Hold on, though. You know Hold I'm on. talking to. Hold on, though. Damn. You hear what you say? If you don't pay the bill, who no, no. can Put the money enjoy on the table. themselves Put the money on the table. if they are living in a bundle of unpaid bills? Who can literally enjoy Not their life? Any. You missing the point here. No, you said it. Yeah, I know. I'm only but echoing you miss, what you I, said. I'm saying what the, but you don't miss the point. What is the point? The point is that when I'm talking about, we're talking about bad and good. Mm hmm Okay. Bad and good what? Bad. We said we talk about bad man, bad Why? She asked the question, mm -hmm. bad man, mm -hmm. bad. Mm -hmm. Man, bad because majority of men, they're just bad. I just gonna say that because they want to be bad. Yeah, they just bad. Lord help me. Okay, Dexter. Hi, Dexter. <laughs> he says he's trying to tune in. Yeah, Big topic Dexter's here. Right. I yeah. trying to catch a fight back. Oh, a flight yeah. back home. Okay, mm -hmm. but I think that teamwork makes the dream work. That's right, Dexter. It ain't nothing about being independent, like some women say, which they mean that they don't need a man. That, oh my gosh, this is long. Yeah, that's why Dexter on the be sitting there. We there. say, um, mm -hmm. I need my glasses, Dexter. Yeah, Dexter. Um, let's see when now. Let's the show and let me read it as we go. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. You keep the yeah, two words. But, just in but like I say, in, okay. That coming from a woman who is married is a great disrespect to her husband it ain't nothing to do with material things it has to be with the both of them being on one accord but bell said that earlier right yeah but majority of women today money is their god I, I, anyhow, I ain't old school. And then, and I can't yeah, you, you can be old school. That's so old school, you are school. But, but you can't perceive that. That's the reality. Listen, to day to day, your marriage is not going to last unless money. Unless what? Money. Because money is needed for bills. Now, the marriage is one thing. The relationship between me and you is a different. Because guess what? I don't know about most other women, but... This is my philosophy. It's going to break down. No, let, let, me tell you, break down. let me tell you my philosophy. Your philosophy. Go my philosophy is this. Mm -hmm. If you into me and I into you, we could sleep on a cardboard on the side of the road. But that's and you. Because you're old school. But new, this new school woman, this woman today, they will find a man in the next week to take care of them bills. Because that's how they've been schooled. Be because of perception. That's how they've been schooled. Yeah. Perception. Their parents tell them from day one. You know what their parents tell them? Don't bring no break man into my house. What are you talking about? Don't start me up on this damn show today. <laughs> man, you me those. Listen. Well, you can't get started because we're an hour and three minutes okay. into the show. Oh, we got to finish this because we're going to finish next week. And we got to bring all parts in this because there's only two parts we bought in. We got to bring all those the parts. Those are questions that were asked. Yeah. We took up the whole show. We took the whole show. This kind of hot because you know why? Reality is people wants to know because they have an issue mm -hmm. and they wants to know how to deal with these issues. They will hide, they throw it out there. So, so we can discuss it, but I can just put it in place next week because we are finished. Because I'm gonna tell you something it ain't just see, there's a lot of problem in the Bahamas. Why marriage is breaking up because of the same issue. Money, yeah, but money issue. Money and sex mm -hmm. should two. not be. They, they should. 
sex should be. You can't separate them. Who do you mean? Not in a marriage. Who do you mean? Because why? Why can't I have sex for free? No, no, you no. Marry listen, me. But guess don't what? Don't start me. Up Hold on, Tony. Sex will be in free. In marriage, in marriage, if a man is not fulfilling his role and response, and that is why you love me. You Hold love on. me for my money. No, 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 no. Boy, that barely. is I take why. Some you. That is why dating is so important. And in the dating process, if you decide that you're going to get married, before you walk down that aisle all pretty and he all handsome, marriage is like a business. If You ought to know and you ought to have a plan as to how you will live. Because in your parents' house, you didn't have to pay bills. And so you didn't have to pay nothing. But when you get in a marriage, or even if you cohabitating with somebody, there's, if you don't own the house, there's mortgage or rent, there's light, there's water, there's cable, all the amenities that make your family life comfortable. So money is an issue. Yeah. And it will always be an issue for a woman. You know why? Because we are wired, even though you all are supposed to be the providers. We are wired, and all men who are honest, because it's said all the time, behind every successful man, there's a good woman. Women get involved in all be. these little nitty gritty. That was used to be. The, old, the, new, the woman today, they ain't getting involved with nothing. You know what they're telling you? That's yours, this mine. That's what most women tell you. Because they will leave theirs for their children. But they will take yours. Don't start me up in your oh, next you. week. The same place, same time. We can finish this. We can finish this next week. Boy Tony, my obligation, I believe, me, me, Tony. Now I talk about Tony now. Tony. I believe I should take care of my wife. Me. Alright? And that's what I believe. But what do you say, Baron? Daddy said, if he broke and you broke, what y'all going to eat? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Baron. <laughs> we eat love. <laughs> love. So, the same love what hey, I say. What? Don't put roof over your head. The same Don't love. put clothes on your back. If you lay Don't down. Don't put food in your belly. Hey, if you lay down on the side of me and we make love, I can sell that. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Any other ladies and gentlemen, we have come to an end of a very heated discussion. Yeah, I had to let her know. But all I can say, love is free. By Jesus Christ, the word of the Lord is free. Love should have no price on it. I'm sorry we didn't get that. In the do, real world. But love should be free. In the real world. You can't live of air. I was saying. And only air is free. Everything else has to be paid for. I end on that. Note. I will say, love is what you give. And it surely and is. You give your heart, Come you receive. Say it's love. If you give love, you receive love. Love is what you give. But love is what you put in it. Do what you get out of it. Exactly. Oh, wait. What you put in it, you get it. Okay. So. So when you come with your love, come with your bundle of money. Well. <laughs> so, hey, hey, what do you have money? Okay. So, so that means. So at least we know at the beginning of the time. The test of the money. For the money, get the money. So. So then I so would expect do? no love. I would expect no money. So of then your point is making no sense. Because it does love. make sense. Because it has to be an agreement, and that's why I keep going back. But if I ain't got no money, you can't agree with nothing. Because guess what? Money. If you don't have money, there is more than dollars in money, you know. If I go out to work, you stay home and keep the house. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's money. So, but, but and shared too long, responsibility. Too long, women who stay home and look at them making no contribution, but they are making contributions. I'm not saying that. That's, no, that's a different money. Point. But what I'm saying. Don't tell me money make my relationship. Because if I ain't got no money, you marry me. And because I lost my job, you ain't gonna put, you know, put me at the house because I don't try that. Anyway, Beryl, you all do well. Our time's gone. Enjoy your week. We see you 
next week. Same, same time. place, same time. COVID. COVID's rampant now. COVID is back. It's back and it's ugly. It's three, what is it, four times ugly than it was before. So, what are we going to do? Go get your stuff. Stick up in your hand. Get your shot. If you want to. Get your, listen, you know if it is. If you want to. Get your shot because that's the only thing you really want to get. Get your shot. Wear your mask. Keep your distance. Wash your hands. That's what you do. And, and those are the things that definitely work. And love. Mass, distance, wash your hands. And love endlessly. Even if you ain't got no money, love the man. Have a good weekend and enjoy. <laughs> we'll be hot next week. Same place, same time. Have a great day.